This is not my final posting to the Zombie Apocalypse Diaries. It is my new first is per, first posting of my new focused effort. Focused on what or whom I don't know. But I now understand that no one, absolutely no one, is capable of understanding what is truly going on. I had some faith that the Intercept, Glenn Greenwald's magazine, was responsible and moral in their reporting of these notes and revelations. I realize now, though I cannot fully articulate my reasoning, that the, inter that the Snowden documents were given to the wrong people. That the efforts to show the world what's really going on will not yield the results that are necessary. Because they are being given, they have been given to the people, to very, to the people who share the same problem. They are two sides of the same coin. Now let me illustrate to you an example of what I'm talking about. Okay. Let's call this a coin. Okay. This is the face of the coin. Okay. This is one side of the coin. The face. It's what you see. It's the other side, right? It's not the same. It's a lot different going on, huh? But it's the same coin. Okay? On this side are the intercept and the Snowden documents and the reporting trying to tell you what's going on. On the other side is what you're told is really going on. And the president squarely in the middle well, he's not in the middle anymore, is he? He's kind of off to one side, looking in the middle, telling you what's going on. I'm using money for a reason. Money hides the truth. See? <laughs> See how clever these things are? They're two sides of the same coin. They have an agenda. Money. Money. So do they. Mr. Scott uh, Cook, no, I'm sorry, John Cook, the editor-in-chief of The Intercept. He's motivated by the same thing the people who are spying you are motivated by. Why? Because they're all zombies. Every single one. Either primary or secondary. This show is far from over. This show will be over when you have finished understanding the truth of what's really going on. That this stuff needs to go away. Disappear. If it disappears, where's the NSA? If it disappears, where's the intercept? There are no two sides to that coin if there is no coin. Isn't this amazing? What's attached to this? Let's talk about what's attached to this. Communications. It's essential to human interaction. We have to pay to communicate with each other. We have to go places Sorry, I don't have my keys on me. Oh. So, travel requires this. And what comes with this? Oh, on the face of it, the NSA. On the other side is the people saying that they're trying to fight the NSA. But they really aren't. Because they're on the same coin, right? Okay. Cars. Transportation. Communication. What else? Health care. What else? Water, food, life itself. Everything about your life, you believe, has to do with this, right? Where can you be without this? Nowhere, right? Okay? Did this exist when you were born? Was it in your hands when you were born? No? Oh, you had to earn it. So you had to earn this. What did you earn? When you fucking grew up and learned how to earn this stuff, you learned how to earn 
What's on the face of it? The NSA. What's on the back? The people trying to tell you it's not tr what's really going on. They're all both on the same side of the same. They're both on the same coin, just on two sides. The coin you weren't born with. The coin you were taught you had to earn. Dispense with it. Dispense with it. If I had my keys, I'd throw them away too. Dispense with it. Oh, look. And now the president's not facing the center. He's off to one side. He's irrelevant. It's that easy, isn't it? Now what? Oh, I can't buy food. I can't buy communication. I can't buy health care. Oh my God, what am I going to do? Oh, what does my dad do? What did my dad do? What's my, oh, what did my parents do? What did my ancestors do? I'm a conservative, and I'm looking to the past for answers. What did they do? What did they do? What did they do? Look fucking further in the past, dumbass! The fucking answers are in your past. Look beyond this. Look before... Oh, let's see. This one was made in 2006. Well... Yeah, I didn't need this bill in 2005 to eat, did I? No, I didn't need this particular bill. Okay, so we've established we don't need this bill. What about the others? Okay, let's go back further. Let's go back before my life. Let's go back to Sweden. Well, my family, oh, I'm sorry, let's go back to Norway. My family had a farm. The large farmhouse. Southern, south... Eastern Nor Norway. It's where the my great grand great great grandmother was born and raised. I guess. Well, oh, they had to have money too. What about what about her great great grandmother? Well, she was the wife of a Viking. How much of this did they have? How much of this did they have? Huh? Well, they didn't need it to buy food. They had tokens for that. Their own tokens. But what about before that? How did they eat before they had their own tokens? What about before the Vikings? What about when we first came to be? Did we have this? How the hell did we eat? Oh my god, how did we have health care? We had to do all that ourselves. Oh my god. And you know what we didn't have back then? The NSA prying into our very thoughts. Or these assholes telling us what the truth is. Yeah, right. Excuse me.